So I'm at one of my favorite spots here in Banff National Park, Johnston Canyon. Uh, when I was here last, it was obviously summertime, uh, but I really loved it. I have an affinity for waterfalls, so it'd be interesting to check out what is likely mostly frozen waterfalls and compare those to the shots the last year. Or not last year, last time I was here. Like this is actually a stream river. Kind of snowed in at the moment. So there's lower falls, upper falls. Both were really nice. There's a whole bunch of other little ones along the way. So as you can see, not a far hike up, but should be enjoyable. Now, speaking of what would be enjoyable, they would make a killing right now. It's these guys right here, but I assume closed for the winter. Let's get this hike on. at the top of uh, Johnson Canyon at the Upper Falls. So I've done a few different compositions, which I've just shown you. But I just kind of want to talk about pretty flat light at the moment. Uh, you know, it is what it is right now. It's, there are blotches of blue, but it's mainly cloud. But I'm going to try to photograph. I've done the sh a shot that I did last time I was here, plus a, some similar compositions of that but was obviously was not here in the summertime where the uh was the ice here so you got some nice blue some nice formations there So I just came from the lower view of the Upper Falls. Actually, it is during the summer when I was here last. It is a shot I really love. See the logs and all that stuff. A lot of people there, the light wasn't that good. People did hop down, as you can see in the video. Which I wasn't ready today. It wasn't worth it. So props gonna go back, a little more light on the ice might make it more interesting and obviously less people so i can set up and uh, take my time but now i'm gonna head back down There's a couple spots including the actual lower falls and another spot uh, that i don't believe i photographed last time so we'll check it out So this is a view of the lower falls. Uh, now in the summertime, this time of day, this would be jam-packed, standing room only. 
So both this time and last time, I actually hiked all the way up to the upper falls first and worked my way back down. So that's obviously what I'm in the process of doing. So I'm gonna have a look, because I really loved my shot here last time. I'm gonna see if I can capture something somewhere, but I gotta go down to that bridge. So what I have set up here is a vertical shot and I am framing with these uh, branches here. I should take another shot because of a slight breeze. Try to get them frozen solid like the waterfall. So I'm just wrapping up my first visit here at Johnston Canyon on this trip. I do hope to come back. The light exactly wasn't stellar at times and I missed uh, one of the waterfalls on the way back. I saw the way up, I'm like, I'll get on the way back. Uh, unfortunately, I walked right past it. Uh, so anyways, I am off and hopefully we'll be back at Johnston Canyon. If not, I would encourage you to explore it. It's highly popular in the summertime. Be warned. Here's a tip. If you've learned nothing from this video today, learn this. If you're here in the summertime, the lower falls is always going to be busy. So if you're here first thing in the morning, hit that up. If you're here late in the afternoon, bypass it, go to the upper falls, and then double back. That's what I did last time, and it worked out well for me. And hopefully that tip works out well for you. Okay, so I'm in my car. Wow. Well, my rental. Uh, I'm about to leave Johnson Canyon and I left you a tip about visiting the upper falls versus the lower falls. Now here is a couple more tips. Now in wintertime you should have a pair of crampons or something like that to help with stability. The trail is mostly fine but at certain parts it does become slick. So I do recommend, and actually they recommend, so it's really not my recommendation. I'm passing on a recommendation from Parks Canada. It's not really mine. So, but wearing crampons, didn't have some today. Uh, so at some points, a little slippery, I managed. Um, this leads to my uh, second, well, I guess third tip of this is if you have any mobility issues, understanding that the lower canyon, lower falls easier to get to than the upper canyon just from a terrain perspective and also a distance. Uh, but even with that being said, both in winter and summertime, you would likely benefit from a hiking pole or two to help give stability. Now there are rails at certain spots which help, but having at least maybe a second or having a hiking pole to leverage at times would be very helpful. At times I did use my tripod as a bit of a stability uh, in part for that, in part because I didn't feel like hooking it to my backpack. I admit, I was a little lazy there. So anyways, uh, that's it for now. Uh, hopefully I'll be back at Johnston Canyon. Uh, if so, you will see more of that now. If not, you'll see the end credits. So thanks for watching, and until next time, bye for now.